That's weird. The bot has done that twice now where we've had false starts, where it plays, like, multiple countdowns. So, oh, well. That happened to me in um, my race versus um, God's Child, and we had to, like, reset. But this is a practice race, so I don't really care. Like, eh, whatever. The bot wants you to go fast. It wants you to go three, two, three, three, two, one, three, go. It's like, okay, cool. Thanks. Thanks for the countdown. That's really useful. <laughs> it's fine, though. It's not that big of a deal. Reminder, guys. This is a tournament race, so please don't. Um, if you want to watch uh, everybody's perspective, it is uh, the pinned message to catch the multi-stream. But please don't give me any hints or um, spoilers or anything like that while I'm in the race. Just to be respectful to all the other racers. Same goes for, like, trying to, like, remind me of things that I need to have in memory. That also just makes it, like, worse practice for me because I need to practice remembering all the items that I have, the relics and stuff like that, so. <sighs> I'm going to try and be in, like, serious race mode to practice being in serious race mode. So if I don't talk to you guys directly as much, that's probably why. Curry and rice. Well, I'm a little slow here, but we should be fine. That should be plenty of speed. Yeah, okay. The strat that I try and do um, is to get as much speed as possible, but that's fine. As long as we have enough to make it through, that's really all that matters. Coral circle, it, okay. And bronze cure my ass. Cube of Zoe, I believe. Don't, don't be alarmed now. But I believe that was not randomized. Potentially, we don't know. There's no way to know. Karma coin. Where are my gamblers at? Dude, if Karma coin was like a super amazing weapon that had like a gamble effect, that would be fun because it would be fun to use. Blood cloak? I'm already wearing the blood cloak. Interesting. No sub weapons that we can use for Slogger and Gaibon, it seems. Karma coin only run. Now we're talking. I'm not getting the dive kick there, but it's fine. It's still probably a little bit faster to do it that way. Yo, $250 drop. That's pretty nice. Probably not worth farming by any means, but you know. It's nice to have a little bit of money. Nothing here. Yo, one dollars. Let's go. If it just made you super busted like Exerd, Johnny. I've never played Exerd, but I do. Even never having played Exerd, I know the stories of Exerd, Johnny. That's how broken he, he seems to be. So that's cool. Who else is in the race? Uh, it's linked uh, in the pinned comment. I'm trying to... Ooh, that might be actually a good strat to, like, damage boost there. Ooh, silver ring? Okay, that's 100% the rando ring. Unless this is a very early... Um, Holy Glasses seed, where we have to go to Holy Glasses early. Very strange. Very strange. Yeah, that's fine. Could be worse. That's fine. Could have been worse. Come 
Okay. Decent start. Oh, I'm going to grab that for the extra iframes, for sure. Potentially. So I know everybody's going to go straight to library. I, however, will do this. This is my little gambit. To check this relic first. Oops. It doesn't always pay off, but it's nice when we don't have anything in logic yet. And it's gravity boots. Okay. So this isn't necessarily, like, that useful. It's useful information, and I can start routing around the idea of having gravity boots. And, like... I mean, I kind of already know what kind of seed I want. Like, what kind of movement and what route I want to take when I find gravity boots. Um, we definitely want to go to entrance. Uh, probably, we'll, we'll still do um, fire of bat and keep first. Because then it gives us extra information about some out of logic locations. Um, also, technically, um, leap stone is in logic with gravity boots. So... But yeah, well, I'm curious to see what we find in the library, though. That level up's kind of annoying, I'm not going to lie. Uh, cool. Yeah, we'll get this for the money. Not bad, not bad. I'm I'm feeling pretty good about the start. Holy symbol. I mean, it's worth buying for sure. Um, Buffalo Star. Mana Prism for 1k. Iron Shield, I can't really afford it. Dark Blade, Shaman Shield, Dark Armor. Duplicator for 8k, can't really afford that either. I mean... I'll get one Mana Prism. 8k for a Duplicator. If anybody got like a lucky diamond drop, that's pretty bad for us. But you know, maybe like that. So I'm going to do the route that I was thinking of doing, which is we're going to go to keep. We're going to check fire of bat along the way. We're going to warp to entrance from there. So pretty standard route. I definitely got this warp, right? Yeah, I did. Okay, good. Very interesting. Am I too far to the... No, I'm good. Yo, boners? Where are they at? Where are my boners? Where have they gone? Uh, our refresh is cool and all. There's a duplicator, so I'm gonna grab it. minutes in. Okay, not bad by any means. Why would you hit me? Come on, man. Okay. 
Yeah, not the fastest fight. I dropped two Tetra Spirit inputs. Oh, well. <clears throat> I also haven't been practicing this movement, like, at all, and I need to. This is definitely a huge advantage for uh, Fire, who has been practicing the hell out of this movement. Opal. Okay, that's our duplicator. Money. Oh, I missed time to jump. Oh, they were just damage boost me. Tribute. Yo, thank you, Godshop. Appreciate you the good luck. And make them your yeah, I need to practice this whole section with the wolf movement stuff now. There's a lot of crazy stuff you can do. And I haven't practiced, like, any of it. And there's nothing here. Wow, okay. Back to entrance we go. Yeah, I'm going to need to make some save states and start practicing. I feel like we're still on decent enough pace. I don't feel like too far behind by any means. Attack potion. Okay. Oh, I didn't get enough speed. If you get enough speed, you can land on top of the, the little thing there and break it as you're running. So you can do that item check quickly. Okay, this was flight locked. So that means Leapstone is at Coliseum. Like almost guaranteed that that's the case. Or it's gold ring into Leapstone. Which is interesting to think about. Like, Gold Ring into the Holy Glasses location has Leapstone. Mm. Or maybe we find the Ring slash Leapstone up here. Oh, yeah. I forgot that th these are also Gravity Boots locked locations. Oops, I wanted to do a diagonal, but that's fine, I guess. It's not that much slower. I think this is probably faster to transform. Right? Because you get to cover that vertical distance, or horizontal distance so much faster. Why would I do that? I don't know. Weird movement. So what are we sitting at? We're sitting at layer... It was... Gravity Boots, Leafstone, Jewel. So everything behind Jewel is layer four. Wow, perfect spacing. Interesting. Come on. Is it worth grabbing this warp? I don't know. I always have a hard time going straight to ca uh, caverns in this exact scenario. I like getting the warp and then going to caverns. 
Because it gives me some options to get back here a little bit faster, I feel like. It's only a little bit of backtracking. Plus, I get this check done, which could always just be like a random, you know, Vlad or something at this point. I don't know. Oh, frick off. Or it's literally Merman statue. Wow, okay. Yo, what's up, Mr. Greggy? Reminder, by the way, I'm being uh, um, rhetorical every time I ask a question. Because we are in a race, this is just me thinking out loud, and I like to give my uh, thought processes. Not having missed here is a little annoying, but whatever. This likely won't matter, but I mean, I won't get baited by it later, I guess. Potentially. I mean, it's not necessarily guaranteed to be good. I don't know. Oh yeah, I forgot to set up the exclamation mark race and um, the thing on stream. But I do have the pinned message happening right now. Is it considered coaching when I spam the creature emote, no, though? No, because you always spam the creature emote. So Jewel of Open is a higher complexity than Merman. So I think that means that Merman isn't like necessarily part of the complexity chain. So Holy Symbol won't, isn't guaranteed to be like a high complexity location that's like high value. But I mean, it's still a location that we can check and we have um, the Snorkel. So I don't see why we wouldn't because at least we could leave there pretty quickly. more. Don't need that. Javelin. Duplicator for AK. Uh, I still don't have money. Weird start, weird start. I think I'm gonna do this strat. I hope for the best. Nice. That wasn't too bad. Was there anywhere I can find the HP Drain mod? Actually, yeah. I think Talik has it up on his website. Uh, if you don't mind sticking around until after this race, I can find you the link. What's up, vampire? Welcome, welcome. Whatever, man. Bad movement. Don't 
Thank you for the good luck. Appreciate it. I mean, we go back for sure. We definitely go back. Yeah, we definitely go back. I do want to check this first, however. And then we go back. Zircon, that's money, baby. That's a hundred and fifty dollar dues. Hey, what's up, Zealous? Welcome, welcome. Hmm. Ooh, Iron Shield. That's actually huge for us, because we didn't really have, like, a great offensive weapon yet. Zircon Ds. Indeed. There was nothing there. There was nothing there. Oh well, we got a uh, iron shield out of it, so I'm not upset. Oh wow, nice jump, dingus. Oh well, we need to untransform anyways, it's not the end of the world. So now, what are we going to find there? Holy glasses? Ooh, stopwatch. Yo, Alucard room check? I'm thinking vanilla holy glasses or mist is the most likely. That's my guess. Also, what happens if you do this? If I soft lock, this will be very funny. Okay, we're good. I wonder what happens if you make it through the room. Probably doesn't soft lock you, actually. You probably uh, regain control, right? Probably. Just a guess. I guess I'll put on that talisman, sure. Might as well. <clears throat> it is holy glasses. Wow. Okay. Um. That feels bad to go there right now. However, I kind of have to. Because, like, we don't really have anything to explore more of the first castle. And the odds of finding mist in the first castle are kind of low. Hmm. Mist... And that wouldn't even, like, unlock much for me. It's just, like, two locations. Um, YOLO. This is for the fans. Oops. Okay, it was useless. Is the heart max up and the life max up not randomized or no, they are, they have to be. I just swear I always see at least one heart and one life max up every time I go down there. Um. If I wanted to go straight to the second castle, which I do believe was the correct play, I probably should have gone through all Rox's quarters. Um. Okay, here's my plan. We're instead going to go from the mine. So that way I can unlock the mine's warp for later. Come on. Dude, I was gaming for two seconds. Let me have this game. Let me be gaming. Um, yeah. 
We'll go this way. Uh, I don't think I have money, actually. I don't remember. We'll go my wide world. We're in the middle of a randomizer race right now. And uh, things are getting a little uh, interesting, that's for sure. Feels bad to go early second castle. Oh, never mind, baby. We have a reason to not go early second castle. Okay, that's good. Granted, it cannot give us bats, which would be nice. Um, you know what? There's no reason to grab this warp now. Why is there a gremlin? Da Whatever. I never. I didn't know they could fill the screen like that. That's a opal. I already have an opal. I just now remembered I grabbed a separate opal. Okay. That's fine. We still have tons of cash if we ever do make it back. A library card would be huge. Hmm. This is tough. This is tough. Oh, I'm just now noticing that Matthew has forfeited this. Wow. That's rough. This is my first save, so the save split's kind of going hard AF right now. Uh, we're going to check Grand Falloon first. It happens. It's also, you know, just a practice race, and if things go really poorly, it might not, like, actually make for good practice. No, 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 don't grab the other one! No, that's so much time lost! I need to figure out a better way to check all those items. Oh, well. Like, I'm not sweating this because it's a practice race, right? Like, I'm trying to go fast and be serious, but I'm also making a lot of mistakes. I also know that I have time to, like, get better, if that makes sense. Oh, that was bad. Can I use the spell, please? Thank you. That was annoying. I think I'm supposed to save split here under these circumstances. I don't actually know. I feel like there's no good way to tell. Like, what is an, is not a good save split. Why was the spike breaker there? That was the most recent one. Why I am poop. Welcome. Sometimes we're all poop deep down inside. Yeah, I feel like safe splitting and lichen it just isn't that great in general. It's just less effective overall. Wow. Wow, so many heart max ups. Jesus Christ. This place had seven heart max ups. Uh, potentially final Vlad. Which means I probably want to full clear first castle as much as possible now. So that way I don't have to come back to the first castle. So this does change my routing slightly. Before I was going to go to the second castle, but now that I did this out of logic, I think it's better to full clear first castle than go second castle. <laughs> Whatever. I was trying to do something cool there. That's what I get for trying to be cool. 
There's like this uh, wolf like jump in midair strat you can do. I think it's better to insert creature. Yeah, sure, man. We will we will make sure to Just trying to get iframes. Um Okay. What am I missing? Just uh Oh, that's really rough that I skipped the waterfall check. Another opal. No library cards. We have, like, all the money in the world. If I find at least one Vlad Relic here, I'm happy. If I don't, then this was a waste of time. Thank you for the good luck. I appreciate it. It might have been a faster way to do this, actually. Yeah, there probably was a faster way to do this fight. Oh well. Another forfeit. Wow, jeez. I wonder what happened. Maybe they died. In a in a un fortunate way. Dude, all rocks is curse. It continues. Never not cursed by all rocks. Into another heart max up. Okay, cool. Cool. Now, skipping Arox is a pretty standard. Yeah, this wasn't worth now. That's really unfortunate. Yeah, skipping Arox is a pretty standard uh, idea a lot of the time. Now I just have to hope that there's just three Vlad relics in the second castle, which is usually unlikely. That or I have to go do uh, the the merman statue check, which I just don't want to do. Like, it's so far out of the way now. And there's no, like, easy way to save split it or whatever, so. Rough. Oh, uh, yeah, the, the ELO system is still active. It's just that the ELO doesn't really, like, mean anything anymore. Well, I mean, it does, but, like, we're not using ELO for the tournament. <sighs> Come on. We're doing these checks. I'm really hoping for a library card. Ugh. Why is it always seeds with duplicators in the shop? The library card is just fucking nowhere. Also, yes, I did see the big bag of money. I have so much money. I have more money than I will ever need right now. And I just can't do anything with it because there's no reason to go back to the shop. Like, there's no convenient way to go back to the shop. At least if I find mist, there's a reason to go back, but... No. 
一百十一，我咁我咁。I don't know, man. This is rough. I swear to God, if there's a fucking Vlad relic at the、uh, merman statue location, I'm gonna piss my pants. Because that means I would be like in such a in incredibly unlucky when it comes to skipping relics, especially today. Thank you for the three months yet. I appreciate it. It makes the concept of poten potentially losing this race because of just randomly skipping the one Vlad relic that I need、uh, a little bit more bearable. Power of mist. Okay. Been loving the tournament coverage on YouTube. Nice. I'm glad you do. Yeah, there's going to be more、uh, tournament stuff on、uh, Dragon Blitz Daily for sure. It will happen. Bro, I kind of want to do left side, but I feel like I'm already behind, so I kind of don't want to do left side. But like behind in a bad way, like I don't know. Like left side with these relics sounds and feels really bad. Um, do I have anything else weapon-wise? Like literally, not a single like usable weapon. That's so annoying. Who comes up with the seed names?、Uh, the race bot. Are you still not dead? Are you just doing negative damage? Like, <laughs> fuck you, Medusa. There's a Vlad relic. Dark Blade. Okay, I'll take that. That's at least something to help、uh, supplement my strategy. Oh frick! That money was unnecessary. I was hoping to maintain some momentum, but I guess not. Okay, not bad. I'll take a two cast on Akhmadon. Best case scenario is we find another Vlad relic soon. Well, best case scenario is both Vlad relics are just in the second castle that I'm missing. 
I need a refill MP here. Like, I have so much money. There's so much money in the seed, but no library cards. Classic. Yeah, more money, please. Thank you. That's what I- that's genuinely what I need. Thank you, game. Still no one's finished yet. Finishing this seed very quickly would be amazing, to be honest. Like, if somebody finished about now, I would be so confused and amazed at the same time. Whatever. We do have the jewel of open. Really? So I can pretty safely make it all the way to, um... To Dingus, uh, butt Beezlebub. It's not enough to kill you, really? Oh. Why did I do it at that level? Whatever. Let's go for Dark Blade. Fuck off, Trevor, you absolute dumb piece of shit. Just die already. Another Garnet, sure. Oh my god, just get in there. I don't even know what to say about the way I've been playing in combination with how weird these seeds have been. Um, no, I want to keep stopwatch. Stopwatch is probably better than doing a little extra damage with the axes here. Not the cleanest fight, but we'll take it. I feel like every seed I've played has just been more and more weird. Now, is it worth going back? I don't know. Probably not. Because what's left for me? Soul of Bat and Silver Ring? I already found a Vlad Relic. At, uh, Spike Breaker. So, I mean, I'm probably gonna find Bat down that line, but it's like, Bat isn't even, like, that important anymore. I don't know. 
Oh, I was asking, uh, hypothetically, Dave, don't actually give me the answers. We're still racing, bud. I'm, I, I am rhetorical in my uh, ab ability to ask questions. Watch library card right here. Big brain. No, first of all, the Muramasa is important because... I swear to God, there's always just fucking heart max-ups in these rooms. They're useless. Whatever, man. I'm trying to... How did that hit me? Well, that slowed us down a little bit. I'll try my best to do this strat. Just kidding, I can't do it. I'll do it the other way. I need to practice this room. The pin message disappeared. It shouldn't have. It's still available for me. I still have the pin message up. Oh my god, MP refill glitch. That's what I get for being the world record holder in glitchless. Double MP refill glitch! You're fucking joking! The same boss, the same I- And it's a Vlad relic, oh my god. <laughs> it's fate, it's literally fate. The the creature double MP refill glitch. I, I don't even know what to say at this point. Mojo Mail might have been worth picking up, honestly. Wow. Wow. I don't even, that's that's crazy. How did I turn around? That was weird. Okay, well, if we just find one more Vlad Relic, we're in business, but I don't know. I mean... There's three checks left. Library card? Okay, well, that makes things a little bit nicer. So there's three checks left in First Castle, one of which has to be Bat. So, I, I really don't know. I'm still doing Force of Echo first, I think. I don't really have anything like that crazy to kill Doppelganger with, except I guess spam... Shield Rod? Oh, that's a Mana Prism. Which would go good with a Duplicator, but... It's always Force of Echo, dude. It's always a Force of Echo. Dude, let's go. That's crazy seed. Insano seed. Dummy even. I'm not even getting that mana prism. It's not worth it. Fuck. I, I need to figure out a better way to move through here. With Wolf, I always bonk. Kind of painful, yeah. Still will be like under an hour, but... Get, stop humping the floor. God damn it. Damn it, dog. Why are you humping the floor? Is 
So the clutch plays were definitely checking creature, for sure. As well as, I guess, not immediately going to the second castle and finding Spike Breaker. I think those were the two things that, like, mattered the most about my routing. Everything else was pretty okay or standard at best. I feel like my movement wasn't particularly good this seed. Obviously getting lucky on the 50-50 at the end helps save like a minute or whatever, two minutes. But I'm trying to think like, the only thing I skipped was, um, was the merman statue uh, check. That's not bad. So I'm, I, I was pretty thorough. Also finding um, Merman before going into the caverns was nice. I don't know. I feel like I covered a lot of options with this route, but it also had the potential to get absolutely blown up by some heavily gamble. I feel like my strategies are basically that. If, if anybody out gambles me, I lose, but I play pretty conservative while only skipping like one or two major things. I think we have a Franker Face Z dog emote. Don't we? I think we do. We also have This Is Fine, yeah. Which is the dog. Yeah, my strength isn't very good. There we go. Yo, GG's. Uh, yo, I'm starting drag now. Congrats. Nice. Yeah, the seed was wild. Hey, GG, I'm man. All right. GG's. Damn. And fire's right behind me. That's crazy. I'd be curious to see what route uh, fire took. Tribute. Thank you for the gifted sub. I appreciate it, Dave. Make them your slaves. Wow, good seed. We ended up uh, barely taking it. That's crazy. I feel like we got super lucky. Thank you for the gifted one, God's Child. Make them your slaves. GG's. Uh, yo, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more epic uh, randomizer gameplay. Uh, and I'll uh, see you in the next video. Thank you. Goodbye. Uh, bye.